Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Like I said last week, I went thrifting and I have a haul for you guys. So we'll just get right into it. The first thing that I got is this vintage watch. It still works and I've already got it adjusted to the time, but it's just this gorgeous gold watch. I was really excited about it because it was $14, but I was just going thrifting around the Bay Area and I had gone into some shops that I had never gone into before. So that was really exciting. And then the next item that I got is this Zara turtleneck. I'll show you what it looks like on. I'm usually not a huge fan of turtlenecks, but I feel like this one isn't that tight around my neck, so I will actually wear it. And I just thought this looked like a really nice fall staple, and I could layer a jacket over it. The next item that I got is this knit sweater jacket. The funny thing is I found this at a different thrift store first, but it was a consignment store or less like a thrift store, more like a consignment store. So the prices there were a little bit higher. And I told my friend, I was like, I think I can find this exact same thing at Goodwill for like a third of the price. So I'm not gonna buy it here. And we went to a Goodwill next and voila we found one almost right away too it was so funny but it fits really nicely and i just thought this would be a nice little piece for the fall similarly it's giving like <laughs> grandma a little bit but i sort of like it And then it wouldn't be a thrift haul if I didn't find a pair of Levi shorts. So I found these, they fit me perfectly. I'm probably not gonna try them on because they're just shorts, but very cute. So this was one of my favorite finds in the entire haul. Uh, I found this Zara dress and i wanted this dress for so long the only problem with it is that the straps are really really long which i think is why it got donated to begin with and i searched on tiktok and it seems like a lot of people have this problem but what i did was i just crossed it over my neck so there's like an x over it i'll insert a photo so you guys can see but basically that fixes my problems so i don't have to worry about it having like having a nip slip or anything like that but one of my favorite pieces for sure just look at the color on that. It's absolutely gorgeous. The next item that I found was this Princess Polly dress. It is brand new. I don't really know why someone donated it. Maybe because it was too short because a lot of Princess Polly dresses are pretty short, but I'm only 5'4", so this dress it's like a little on the shorter side, but I can handle it and it's so cute. And I styled it with a little belt. The next item that I got was this, I don't even know how to describe this. It's like suit material, but it's a tank top and it's got buttons down the middle, which I thought would look really cute. Sort of similar to this and that's sort of how I plan on wearing it. So obviously normally I wouldn't have clothes under it when I'm wearing it, but this is the idea of how I would be wearing it. Thought it was really cute. The next item is this Giants shirt. I got it because I went to a Giants game the other day and I was told that I would be going again. And I just thought this was really cute. I could just wear it over a tank top and go to a game and it would just be like a really nice outfit. And the next item that I found was this white button down and I thought that it was really pretty and like fairy like or pirate like and Halloween is coming out so I thought maybe I could do something with it but I'm not sure if I'm even going to dress up but if I do I feel like I could use this piece but even if I don't I feel like it's a really nice basic piece to wear and pretty easy to style because it is white. 
and it's, it's so flowy and I feel like there's there's an extra detailing on it it's just right over here and the bottom is a little more flowy than the top it is really oversized on me but I still thought that it would look really nice I typically don't buy basics when I go out thrift shopping because I don't know I just feel like you can get it anywhere but I found this sweater that I thought was super good looking and basic and I really like the material of it I don't know if you can like tell how thick it is but I really like this material and I thought it would be really nice for just wearing as an everyday little shirt and the best thing about it is definitely the fit I like how it's slightly cropped so just where it sits is really really nice And then one of the pieces that I am most, most excited about, and this is the last piece in my haul, is this red leather jacket. It's from Nine West, um, but I got it at Goodwill for $25, and I feel like that's pretty good because usually at their stores, leather jackets are quite overpriced, so I'm always worried about it. But just look how nice it looks. It fits me perfectly. I don't know what size it is. It's definitely oversized. I saw it when I was checking out behind the register and I asked the lady if I could see it because I was like I've been looking for a red blazer like I just have to try it on and she couldn't figure out what size it was because whoever owned it before had cut off like the sizing tag on it but I tried it on anyways and it fits me perfectly or exactly the way I want it to fit and I'm so happy I found it so thank you guys for joining me today that's all I have I was really excited about this thrifting haul I've been trying to be a little bit better about not buying new items. I've been wanting to find things that fit my wardrobe that I can find at a thrift store just because it's cheaper and it's better for the environment and that's just something that I'm trying to get more into. I also feel like I need to clean up my closet now because I have so much stuff and I feel like I've just recently started finding what I really like to wear and finding outfits that make me feel happier. But thanks for joining me and I'll see you at the next video.